is Tina from Tina's Messy Crafty Life. How are you? I hope you're good. I am here with Art Therapy Card Deck. Miss Cat's Crafting picked this up. And when she explained it, I thought, oh, that looks fun. I could use a little art therapy, can't we all? Sometimes prop cards, or so I'm calling these, just help. You're focused a little bit. Or you're, you get, like, I call it art crafter's block, artist block, reading block, you know, writer's block. I, sometimes I run into that. So, I had this in my wish list. And my grandkids bought me this for my birthday. So, along with that, I ordered a mixed media heavyweight journal. It's pretty good paper. I'll give them that. It's not as thick as I would have thought, but it'll work. And I'm going to, I will tell you straight up, there'll probably be things in here I will substitute, but try to, to kind of go along with the card, but substitute a little bit. So, this week was goal for your activity to give your guys size, got yourself guidance. And you're supposed to trace each one of your hands, your right and left, and then in your left hand, see my pen came through, um, you were to okay, put your hands down, trace them. And you are two in your left hand, write things in your life you want to let go. So I did that. And then in your right hand, write anything that you want to call into your life. And that's what I kind of did here. And it's pretty sloppy writing. And then decorate the background. So that's what I did. And there's my hands. So that is the week card one. Now I may do two cards a week. I may do one card a week. This is something I'm just going to do when I want to do it. I'm going to try to do at least one card a week, but if I say I get up in the middle of the night and I have nothing to do, I may pick a card and just do it. So, and then what I'm going to do is, once I do the cards, I'm going to move them to the back because eventually I'll go through it again. What I want to do is try to get this, all these done by the end of the year. It's my goal. So then next year, I start all over and see where I am and kind of look back. Okay? And some, like I said, I'm not a big watercoloring, and I don't think this water could handle it. So anything that's called for watercoloring is going to probably be just paint or colored pencils. You know, in that aspect. Just so you know. Like the next one is number two card, Sensory Still Life. Oh, boy goal for activity to calm through your mindfulness. Assemble some fruit vegetables from your kitchen in front of you. Use watercolor pencils or sketch a scene. Then add water with your paintbrush to blend the colors. Use the pencil to add more shading after the wet color dries. Focus on your senses. What do you see, smell, taste, feel, or hear? <laughs> well, and then it says for the cost in, in it, exploratory question. Were you able to tune into your five senses? Which sense felt easiest to tune in? Does your level of calmness feel different after this extra? How can you apply this mindfulness practice to the citron during the day? Well, I'll tell you right now. I can't draw, so right there it's not going to work for me. So what I'll probably do is I'll just go find me a coloring Im image of vegetables and fruits, and I will color that. I'm still try to do the seeds, the smell, taste, feel, or hear. Plus, I don't have any. Me and Scott don't buy a lot, a lot of fruits that are whole. I usually buy frozen fruits. So, that wouldn't work. So, that's where I said I will come up with something else for the card if, the, if it works. But I'm going to try to do the same thing, but just use different mediums. There we go. That makes sense. So, this is where I am tonight so or today it's it's eight, quarter to nine here on friday the eighth so thanks for watching everybody if hey go check this out it's on amazon i think i pay i yeah yeah i didn't buy it i just put it i think it was 15 so i don't not sure what the kids spent so once in a while diamond gets coupons from amazon because she does the polls or something so already thanks for watching everybody be happy be kind be safe be funny be crafty and bye for now